be the little spoon bitch. Just telling you right now, that's how I roll. I'm a top. Unless you're real hairy, then I'll be a bottom. All right. All ladies show. All ladies show. Uh, I have one last song for you. But first, I'm going to take a poll. I'm going to take a poll right here and right now. Because we are at the kind of convention where I can, I can actually gather this kind of data. There are two songs that have been kicking around in my head. And they're both about particular fandoms. Now, they're equally developed, meaning I have just about as much information. And when I say equally developed, I mean a 12-year-old girl and you. You're welcome. I'm a 12-year-old girl. You're going to be a 12-year-old girl tonight. What is the wrong with me? In any case, I have these two songs. They're equally developed. They're both about two different fandoms. When should I grow boobs? Shut the fuck up. When you're 13. That's tomorrow. It's a, different, it's a different adventure. So, should I finish my song about My Little Pony Friendship is Magic? Which is about Discord. It's a villain song. You know that's what I do. I do villain songs. Or should I finish my song about Death Note? Take a quick poll. All right, we're gonna use the hando meter. My Little Pony. Death Note. All right, thank you. I know what I'm supposed to do. Did you just chuck a Death Note at me? You know, I love it when people come up to me with Death Notes and they're like, "Can you can you sign my Death Note?" And it's like such a fucked up thing to ask someone to do. Because you're basically saying you're gonna die, right? Oh, is that your death note? I'm gonna sign more than your death note. In my seed. What is wrong with me? It's an all ages show. Hold on a second. I know what the problem is. The problem is I've lost myself. Let me regain my balance. It's a good way to regain balance. You know, my show is built inaccurately. People like to say he's a renaissance man, he does this, that, and the other thing, he writes books and makes toys, he sings songs. Really, what it should be called is watch an old dude get drunk. <laughs> he might sing. <laughs> Story time with Uncle Revolti. <laughs> alright, so, alright, I'll work on my Death Note song, that's what I'll do. So. But for the time being, I'm going to leave you with my last song of the evening. Thank you so much for coming out tonight. Uh, I do have Raised by Bats, although I didn't bring anywhere near enough for the amount of people who are here. So please beat each other to death. <laughs> oh, you already got yours. Well, there you go. No one's getting this. It's That was Japanese. I already got those. Uh, yeah, the booth is like right outside the door. Come say hello. Let's take a picture together. Just let me know how old you are before there's any, any inappropriate groping. <laughs> when the time is too busy. A <laughs> too much. They call on me by name, you see, for my special touch. <laughs> to the gentlemen, I'm misfortunate. To the ladies, I'm surprised. But call me by any name. something interesting recently about this song. It's a meme, apparently. It's really weird. If you go to YouTube and you search for this song, When You're Evil Plus Disney, you don't come up with one video. You come up with like several hundred videos that small children have made cutting Disney villain footage to this song. Every Disney villain ever in existence. Do you often search yourself plus Disney? I su I'm searching myself as we speak. <laughs> okay, so let me just call you. Raise your hand, please, so I can see who you are. No, no, who, who said that? You? What's your name? Uh, Christian. Oh, you're Christian. Christian, you're being such a douchebag. 
<laughs> I love you to death, but you're being a douche. Because no successful business ever said, oh my god, it's so arrogant to Google yourself. <laughs> like, their entire teams at Coca-Cola who Google Coca-Cola all fucking day long. Stop trying to explain yourself! I forgive you, Jesus, shut up! But it all really started out when someone sent me a video, like, hey, have you seen this? It's your song, When You're Evil, cut to, like, some Disney villains. And I was like, oh, awesome. And, like, a month later, I wanted to show it to somebody at Disney. To show them that they should hire me to write villain songs. And, like, 200 videos came up. And it was one of those moments where I was like, all right, so they probably illegally downloaded the song. And then they illegally downloaded all this footage. And then they cut it together and, you know, I don't make a cent off of any of this. But neither does Disney! <laughs> We're finally on equal footing! <laughs> Alright, so now, seeing as this is the very, very, very first time that a Midwest Media Expo is happening, I think it's only right that I should cast my musical. Voltaire plays When You're Evil at the Midwest Media Expo. I'll be playing the part of Voltaire. <laughs> but I need to cast the Beelzebub Philharmonic Choir. Now, in order to be in the Beelzebub Philharmonic Choir, you must be able to fulfill one of three requirements. One, you must know all of the lyrics to the chorus of this song. If that's you, raise your hand. Or two, you must know most of the lyrics to the chorus of this song. If that's you, raise your hand. Raise your hand, babe. Do you know? Or three. First. Keep your hand up. You must be able to fake the lyrics to the chorus of this song. If your hand was up at any time whatsoever during that casting process, I want you to slowly, calmly, safely, Find your way onto the stage. Go. Go. I have a few simple rules. One of them is you must be safe. And you must be kind to the people around you. Another one is, if you spill my rum, you're fired. And number three, and I can't even believe I have to have this as a rule, but it's happened so many times lately that it's now a rule. If you take this hat off of my head, I'm going to kick you right in the mouth. Now, guys don't generally know this. Actually, you know what's really horrifying is mostly women do it. Mostly women do it. Women get drunk and they're like, oh my god, I'm gonna wear your funny hat. But what you don't know is like, if you wear a hat all night long and someone takes it off of you, you look like the fucking Crip Keeper. I don't wanna look like the Crip Keeper! Thank you. Uh, that's my ass, people. Getting really out of control. Ladies and gentlemen, the Bills about Philharmonic Choir. I'm the fly in your suit. I'm the pebble in your shoe. I'm the pee beneath your bed. I'm a bump on every head. I'm the peel on which you slip. I'm a pin in every head. I'm the thorn in your side. Makes you wriggle. There's children to make sad, while there's candy to be had, while there's pockets left to pick, while there's grannies left to trip down the stairs, I'll be there. I'll be waiting round the corner, it's a game I'm glad I made, cause there's one born every minute. Why? I'm evil apparently.
monsters they become I'm the nightmare in your skull I'm the dagger in your back An extra turn upon the rack I'm the quivering of your heart A snapping pain, a sudden start So it's not a stop motion presentation. So it's gonna be whatever the fuck you want it to be. It might be, maybe it'll be another concert, maybe it'll be a QA. So just show up tomorrow, we'll figure out what it's gonna be then. Good night, thank you. Yeah. 